Today, I'm gonna to show you guys how to get your own free Bedrock Minecraft server. So the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go to this website right here, which I will link down in the description. And yeah, you're just gonna to wanna to copy that link into your browser and then go to sign up right here. This part doesn't really matter that much, but you just wanna put in whatever username you want right here and then click on the agree terms of service and click next. From here, you wanna put in whatever password you wanna use and then just retype your password Put in whatever email you want to use for this, and then click sign up. After that, you're going to be brought to this page right here, and you just want to click on create server or create a server. At this point, it's going to ask you if you want to make a Java edition server or a Bedrock server. You're going to want to click on Bedrock and then create. Um, and from here, you're going to have all this stuff. You're going to want to make sure you're on the most recent version of Minecraft. So to start your server, you're just gonna to wanna to click on this big green start sign right here and do uh, accept the EULA. Now this could potentially take a little bit for it to um, for it to work, for it to start up because there is, um, given that this is a free way of doing this, um, there is a limited amount of servers that can be open at once. So this could take a little bit, but generally, depending on what time of the day you do this, it might not take too long. Like right now, yeah. There was no wait time for me personally. I was able to get this up in like 30 seconds. So, and this is with a free server. You don't have to pay, so that's really convenient. From here, you're going to want to open up your Minecraft on whatever you're playing on, be it Pocket Edition, Windows 10 Edition, or even the Console Edition, which I will leave a link in the description if you want to know how to join servers on Console Edition. Okay, yeah, so from here, you go to play, servers, and scroll down here to add a server. And you're gonna wanna take this um, address right here, just kinda copy that real quick, and go over to Minecraft, and you can control view that into there. Next, you're gonna wanna do the same thing with the port right here, just copy that, go to Minecraft, and paste it into the port section right there. You can put in whatever name you want for that. Um, it doesn't really matter. And you can save that so it will show up right here on your additional servers list. From here, you're just going to want to go to your server, click join server. And with that, you're going to be in your world. That's going to be it for my tutorial. If this did help you, remember to leave a like. And that's going to be about it. Goodbye.